Hey YouTube, what is going on? This is Nate here with Nate's Tech Update. And in this video I'm going to be demoing another great feature from iOS 5 Beta 1 and that is be, uh, making iDevices PC free. So normally when you would uh, bring home your iDevice from the Apple Store such as your iPad or your iPhone it would immediately prompt you to connect it to iTunes when you would turn it on. This would be a pain in the butt a lot of times. Now you can simply just slide to unlock and it will prompt you to set up your iPhone right onto the device. So let's just go ahead and slide to set up. So the first thing it's going to ask is for your language. So English, you can go ahead and press the arrow. It's the next. Um, then you can choose your country, so United States. Hit next. And now it'll ask me about choosing a Wi-Fi network. I'm going to go ahead and just skip over that step. But then you would enter in your passcode if you are on a uh, locked network. This next screen that is brought up will allow you to restore your device from a backup. Uh, this feature has not been fully implemented yet, but will be when iCloud is fully implemented this fall, uh, along with the release of iOS 5. But this will be great if you ever needed to restore your device for whatever reason you're having issues with it. You could immediately get your iPhone back to the way it was before the restore. Or let's say you had an iPhone 3GS and you upgraded to the iPhone 4, you could get all your apps and settings and contacts, everything the way it was, onto your new device. It also gives you the option to restore from iTunes, which you would have to do through the uh, regular USB cord. I'm going to go ahead and press next. Next it will ask you to sign in with your Apple ID, and this will basically get you set up with iCloud so it backs up everything that you do if you ever need to restore your device or you want to see your apps or music or anything that you need to download from iCloud. So I'm going to go ahead and just enter in my information real quick. Upon completing that step, it'll bring you to a screen that asks you about setting up Mobile Meet, which I currently have a subscription for, so I'm going to leave that uh, to on and go ahead and press Next again. And it'll also ask you about turning on Find Your iPhone. So uh, if you ever lose your iPhone and you go on another iOS device or your computer, you can track the location of it. And diagnostics, uh, this will help Apple if you send them your diagnostics for any bugs or whatnot. And go ahead and press next. And uh, now we can go ahead and start using our iPhone. And there you have it. That is the easy new setup that will be available with iOS 5 this fall, completely removing the need to immediately plug in your iOS device to the computer after purchasing it. Some other things that Apple is doing to make your device completely PC free is uh, you can now, if you go into the uh, settings app and we go into general here, you can now get software updates over the air. So instead of having to plug in your iOS device in order to update the software, you can do this uh, over your Wi-Fi connection. Currently, um, it doesn't seem that anything's available, but this is a beta, so I'm assuming that Apple hasn't really enabled this feature. It'll probably be enabled in future betas, uh, probably closer to the release uh, sometime this fall. Um, there's also iTunes Sync, so if you did want to continue to use your computer with your iPhone, you still can uh, wirelessly without actually having to plug it in via you, the 30-pin dock connector. Um, I'm not sure if this feature has been enabled at this point. I don't really know how to get it working. If any of you uh, uh, viewers know out there know how to do this, leave a comment below so I can put up a demo on how to do it. Uh, but that is what Apple has done to make the iDevices more of a PC-free device. And uh, thanks for watching. Uh, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about this feature. And as always, have a nice day.